Hi everyone, welcome to my channel Kasumi Chris. My name is Crystal and today I will do a video about my 8 month NoFap journey. In the beginning of this year I started NoFap. NoFap is not masturbating and not watching porn for a set amount of time. It is also called No PMO. I challenged myself to go 90 days without masturbating, without watching pornography and without orgasming. Now, as you can see from the title, I went a lot longer than that. But why? Why would I do this? Isn't this something for guys? I asked myself these questions, but I didn't have the answers to them back then. I just saw it as a challenge and I like challenging myself. I also didn't know why people would do this, if there were any benefits to it and if people struggled with this. I was ignorant about NOFAP. Now before I get into the details, I want to share a little bit about my background before all this. I was a girl who had big self-esteem issues, but I always walked around with a smile on my face. I had a hard time trusting myself. I had difficulties continuing things. I lacked passion and motivation in life. I just went along with what everybody expected of me. I also struggled with a lot of acne and I had body issues. Now, I didn't think that my behavior surrounding masturbation and pornography was problematic. I also should mention that I wasn't heavily addicted to it. I used it as a form of escape and a way to instantly feel better. So, in the beginning of this year, I started the challenge. The first two weeks into NoFap, I got a huge increase of motivation. I woke up out of bed with a huge smile on my face and I was so grateful for getting to experience a new day. My to-do list were getting done way more easier than before. I started to become more present in my day-to-day -day life. I just wanted to get out there and do stuff. My happiness increased. My energy levels increased, my mental clarity increased. I also realized how I could master my mind, that I was the master of my mind and how I could use my mind as a tool. Eventually, after more than a month on NoFap, I felt like I wanted to share my experience so far. Because I'm that kind of person that once I try something and it turns out to be very beneficial and very positive, I want to share that with other people so they can benefit from it too. I did feel weird sharing something private like that, but I did see the bigger picture of this and how it could help others. When I got this new burst of energy really out of nowhere, I already like leveled up my life by going vegan. I in my so opinion, I don't think I look very nice in that video. Comparing to myself today, I think I look better. I also think I think more positive. Now, NoFap doesn't make you think more positive. It doesn't make you look better. It doesn't make you feel better. But it opens up doors for you. With all that extra energy and time, you want to go through these doors. You want to start improving yourself, as I did. I took more care of myself, spiritually, mentally and physically. I felt better and people started to notice that. I also got told how much more attractive I've got, but they couldn't really pinpoint what it was exactly. I also started to attract more people into my life. I started to feel more confident and less awkward. I never really liked talking to people that much, but now I get into conversations with strangers all the time. And somewhere after the 90 days, I started getting a high from getting out of my comfort zone. It wasn't always positive though. I had mega urges. I had this really bad flatline period which I couldn't leave my house in over almost two weeks. I also started questioning my sexuality. Yeah, um, I felt like I was becoming asexual or something. Fortunately, cold showers helped me a lot with the process. 
it really increased my willpower. Also eating healthy helped wonderful for me. I went from a plant-based vegan diet to a raw vegan diet. I also started exercising a lot more or I wanted to exercise a lot more so I became leaner I think more flexible and I lift heavier weights right now. I became a better listener because I live more in the present moment. I also think my genitals look a lot nicer right now. <laughs> Just this whole experience was like with its ups and downs. It was really just pure magic to me and it is still. Now I'm not saying you should stop masturbating. I am saying however that you should stop watching all that nasty free porn because that is messing with your brain. Now, if you feel unhealthy, if you feel depressed, if you have social anxieties, if your emotions are just this big roller coaster ride, try out NoFap and see what it does for you. If you don't suffer from any of these things and you try out NoFap, maybe it doesn't do much for you. I don't know. I'm not sure. I am only sure about my own experience and about all of the anecdotal evidence I found online from people sharing their benefits with each other. Now this journey is not going to be easy. It's going to be pretty hard, but it is totally worth it. Please let me know if you got inspired to do 90 days of no PMO. And maybe you're already doing NoFap. How long is your streak? How long have you been doing this? Leave it in the comment section down below. You can find more videos about NoFap on my channel. I also do vlogs. I film mukbangs. I share health and fitness things. I also like sharing things about natural living. Currently I'm writing an ebook about how to stop masturbating and stop watching porn for boys and for girls because you know I'm a girl and I wanted to share my experience for other girls out there so stay tuned for that. Subscribe to my channel if you want to stay updated with my content. Also hitting the little bell will help so you will get notified whenever I upload a video. Also, if you like this video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. That would help me out as well. Find my other social media links in the description box down below. I really want to thank you so much for watching and I hope to see you another time on my channel. Bye.